guys so in today's video i'm going to show you how to control iphone with your macbook so with the new update of iOS 18 and mac os 15 sequoia you cannot do anything on your iphone from your macbook so let me show you how to set it up and how to use it so the first thing is head over to your settings and click on software update just click on general and click on software update so if the official version is ready you can just install that but right now it is only developer beta that is available so that's what i am using so just install the developer beta or the official version if it is available and you need to do the same thing for is 18 on your iphone just open your settings once you open your settings click on general click on software update and update your iphone so once you have done that you are going to see this iphone mirroring icon on your macbook you are going to see it in your dock so let's say you have updated your macbook and you can't find this icon in your dock you can add it very easy just open your finder click on applications and click on search after that search for iphone mirroring and you cannot drag it to your dock so once you drag it to your dock it's going to add it to your dock successfully so once you have added it to your dock or if you have it in your dock already just open it once you open it if it is your first time you are going to see something like this so your iphone on your mac just click on continue and once you click on continue on your iphone it's going to ask you to enter your password once you enter your password you are going to see iphone mirroring is ready to use so just click on get started once you click on get started you will have to turn off the screen of your iphone so just click on the side button to turn off the screen and now everything on your iphone is going to show on your macbook so as you can see this is it so let me close this and as you can see everything on my iphone is showing on my macbook so you can do anything right here so you can open any app and if you want to switch from one app to another just take your mouse to this up section and click on this app switcher you can also click on this to go to your home screen and you can use this to switch apps so as you can see you can basically do anything let me open my facebook so you can see that it is working perfectly so that's it you found this video helpful smash the like button and subscribe to my channel for more amazing videos like this thanks for watching